listen up, baby girl. I'm trying to make your mind feel my destination. When times chill, no hesitation. Plot, plan, stack, and build. With this game in my brain I obtain. Now you talking all this deja vu. Shit, it is what it is when invested in something greater than you and me too. You did. Shout out to Freeze, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, it's kind of like I'm taking this idea, but you know, great minds think alike. It's actually something I had thought about before I even seen bro start dropping his videos consistently like he been on it. So, uh, go check him out too, man. Shout out to Freeze, is it? What's going on, family? This y'all man's fresh the best. Do you want some bread, man? You know what I'm saying? Do you want to uh, manifest that ancient motherfucking word so that way you could be walking around with some motherfucking herbs and big motherfucking loafs in your pocket? Is that what you want? You know what I'm saying? Well, we gonna go ahead and tap into that and I'm gonna show y'all how to get down and go ahead and manifest that for yourselves today. Cause you know me, man. I'm constantly planting them seeds in my mind cause I want some bread. You know what I'm saying? I'm hungry. I'm on the paper chase. You see what I'm saying? But yeah. We on the mission for commission, but don't get it misunderstood, man. It's all about this information, this uncommon information that is. So, yeah, go ahead, get your shit together. You know how we do. Like, comment, subscribe, and we gonna go ahead and get into it, yeah. You have to be destined for greatness. You gotta know it's not nothing that nobody in this world can do to stop you from achieving what you wanna achieve in this life. Because if anybody can stop you from achieving what you want to achieve in life, then that's not something that you actually really wanted to do. Because a person who actually want to achieve success and whatever that they love to do, they going to live by it, die by it, breathe it, and take it, eat it, sleep it. They going to do everything with it. You see what I'm saying? So you want to be able to tap into that energy of knowing nothing. You, you want to have tunnel vision. Nothing can come in between this tunnel that you got towards your vision and your goal your destination but first you got to set yourself out a road map and a plan a guide to get yourself to that destination and that's where those seeds you're going to plant those seeds in your mind for plants to grow for those plants to be bred and fruitful you know what i'm saying abundance you want all that but first like i said you want to plan it out so that way you can get to that destination of fruitful and abundance but you gotta understand the the joy and the um the experience come within the experience within the journey. You know what I'm saying? So you don't wanna have your mind so focused on you know getting to the um the destination that you're not enjoying the journey at all, that you're not taking time appreciating the small steps that you are taking towards your greatness, taking towards your happiness, you know. And that's something that I had to uh, critique myself on at times because we, like we always say, we, none of us is perfect. So we all have to consistently keep growing on a daily basis. It's just that, you know, I'm here to bring the information from what I done learned, you know, from what I done had to gain patience from and gain patience with. And now I'm here and I'm able to analyze situations more so than reacting. Um, I'm able to act accordingly to the situation. Okay, so the reason that I use the word bread in this title is because it's a term that's known around the ghettos, around the uh, project areas, or around the less fortunate areas, you know what I'm saying, to say the least, to put it in lamest terms. It's a word that's commonly thrown around, and we all know what bread is. We all want some bread. You know, uh, you know when your mama send you to the store to get some bread, you got to go get that, you know, you got to make it happen. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you ain't even got the money. You ain't got the bread to get the bread. So you might have to go out and get both of the breads. You see what I'm saying? So this is something that we uh, we equate to our uh, ways of living, our means of living, which is finances and money. We uh, put the word or the slogan, the term, whatever you want to call it, we put it with that word in the ghetto which is bread for all the people who don't know. So let me go a little deeper than that. In ancient times, they also used the word bread, you know what I'm saying? And they also used it as a um, prophecy. You know, when you had loaves of bread, that mean you had miles to feed. That mean you had the capabilities, you had the uh, whereabouts to go out and the means to go out and, and make that happen, you know? Uh, and then in other cultures, they use pigs as the uh, the form of the money or the form of currency, the form of bread. 
you know so it's just all about the times that we in so bread is a form of currency in ancient times which is a form of currency now that's why we call it bread <laughs> but uh you want to be planting the seeds in your mind you want to be installing the downloads on a daily basis and, and plant the seeds in your mind saying basically that you know you can be all that you gonna be and that you want to be it shouldn't be not one thing in this world that come against you on a daily basis transforming your mind and planting seeds in your mind because if you don't do it somebody's going to do it you got to understand not acting is acting you see what i'm saying so not um putting in those motions not putting in putting in the work to manifest what you want to manifest in your own mind somebody else gonna put those thoughts and those ideas in your head whether you like it or not whether you want them to or not that's just how the subconscious is programmed so you have to be programming it on a daily basis on a constant basis in order for your mind to start developing the things that you see that you vision and want inside simple as that and you go look up and your whole life go been to pass you by you gonna bend the lid your whole life for somebody else you gonna be in the put all your time and energy thinking that you helping yourself going to a job working for somebody else everything you do is gonna be revolved around somebody else's life it's never gonna be for you but we don't want that to be you because we all come from them hard times we all come from them um them hard places in our mind where it's uh you know, we got to find ourselves at some point. When we kids, we can roll freely. We can do what we want to do. And we didn't have to worry about all these adult things. Now that we adults, you know what I'm saying, we get stuck and we get caught in a cycle of, um, you know, thinking logical and suppressing our dreams and suppressing the ideas that, you know, creatively come to us. We suppress it because we too focused on, I can't think about that, that ain't real which in real life, that's what's really gonna make you prosperous and happy on the inside or joyful on the inside and happy on the outside. But you rather think about work and think about going um, to work for another man. I don't know why you rather think about it because when you think about it, you rather not think about it. When you thinking about it, you talking about, man, I don't wanna be thinking about work. I wish I didn't have to go to work. I just wanna take a trip. And, so why even think about that? Why not work towards the dreams and the plans, the goals that you have within the aspirations that you already like to do? Work on those things so that way you don't have to even worry about thinking those thoughts, let alone saying, I don't want to do this. You see what I'm saying? But then this is going to be a quick little video, man, uh, tell y'all about prosperity. Plant your, seed, plant your seeds in your mind. Your mind is the soil you. So use your mind, fertilize it every day, get new information, tap into uncommon information. If it's somebody trying to be around you, trying to uh, be in your presence that ain't trying to help you grow, that ain't, you know, uh, on the same path that you on, then they hindering you and you got to do your best to get away from those people. But in the meantime, between time, still, you know, do your best to uh, advance those people as well. You know, you want to be able to have a balance it's a reason you're around those people you see what i'm saying so stay balanced know yourself plant your seeds in your mind your soil and watch it grow so that way you can get that bread you dig what i'm saying but yeah man it's y'all man's fresh the best you already know what time it is if you already got love <laughs> if y'all already got love for me if y'all already got love for me and you already know i already got love for you but if you want to send some love to me then you know i'm sending that back at you tenfold man 100